When you think of suction tools, you imagine a suction cup working on a piece of glass or metal, something really dense and flat. But here at Grabo, we take it to the next level. We offer powerful suction on some of the most porous materials, such as plywood or drywall or even rough pavers. So what exactly is a porous material? Well, think of a sponge or even a piece of rough wood. These materials have tiny or sometimes even microscopic air pockets or holes that air or water can bleed through. But the Grabo is no ordinary suction cup. This is an electric tool that uses an advanced electric vacuum pump to pull air and maintain suction on even the most porous materials. I have here a Nemo Grabo. Now the Nemo Grabo is an electric cup that pulls air continuously and makes sure that it maintains a hold on even porous materials. Yes, flat dense materials are the easy one, but rough and porous materials are where people start to get curious and see if it will work or not work on that specific material. Let me show you some of the differences on a piece of wood. So right here, this workbench is pretty rough, but also it's very flat and very dense. I should not have any issues getting a firm grip on this material. It's beginning to suck down and I can see on my pressure gauge if I have suction. Now this is a Nemo Grabo, so it's only going to turn off when I intentionally hit the power button. Now this material is dense, like I said. There are no air holes and air pockets through the material. If I was going to be losing air in the vacuum chamber, I would visually see the pressure gauge start to drop. Let's look at this right now. Over the next minute or so, this will drop to zero. So very slowly, we are gonna be bleeding out from this material. I have here a piece of drywall, or gypsum board, or plasterboard, or sheetrock. This material is very popular and it's used for walls, ceilings, interior structures. Now the gypsum is a soft, sulfite mineral which provides the strength and structure. The paper on the outside acts as the protective coat which can be finished or painted. Because drywall is not a firm, dense, hard, rough material, it is a soft paper and very, very porous material. So we are not going to obtain a full suction on this material. While the Grabo is strong enough to lift it, it's not gonna maintain that strong suction for a very long period of time. I'm getting a read of about six PSI. Now that's fine because this material does not weigh that much. It's holding fine, I'm in the green, my pressure is reading fine, and I should not be able to lose grip. Until I turn the motor off, I can see it's dropping rapidly, and over time, I will lose suction because it's bleeding through, and this will eventually drop. We understand that accidents happen and materials do drop. Whether the vacuum pump dies, maybe it's hit accidentally, or maybe you didn't actually see your pressure reading, and then you have a broken material, which could be very pricey. That's one of the reasons why we always say safety first. You have to visually check your pressure reader to make sure that your material is not gonna drop. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.